welcome back to the Mimic PC tutorial series. In today's video, we're going to explore Focus, a simple open source image generation application. We'll dive into its features like generating an image, importance of choosing styles, how to use upscale feature, how to generate an image using LoRa, using image to image generation, and exploring in paint and out paint feature. So first, let's explore the image generation feature. This is the main dashboard of Focus. In this box, enter a positive prompt for the image you want to create. When you click Advanced, you'll see a side navigation bar with many settings. In the preset settings, you can select the type of image you want to create. I'll choose Realistic. You can also customize the generation's performance according to your needs. The aspect ratio comes next, and you have a variety of options to choose from. I'll go with a ratio of 1 by 1. The next step is to choose the number of images you want to create. Below is a negative prompt box. As I have selected realistic as my preset, the model has automatically entered the negative prompt. Finally, I'll untick the random option as I need a fixed seed so that I can showcase comparisons between the generated images. Scroll up to the styles tab. It provides a preview of the style. Right now, I'm not going to choose any of them. Later on, we will dive deeply into this tab. The next tab is models. From here, you can choose a base model from a large number of options. Choosing the right model is important. So make sure you select the one that matches your needs in your entered prompt. A LoRa model was randomly selected below. Remove it for now since we are going to explore it later. Next, select the advanced tab. You can change the guiding and image sharpness values. I'll keep them as default. Finally, click on the generate button. So let us skip the generation process and see that our images are ready. It looks extremely realistic and stunning. Let us now discuss the importance of selecting different styles. Styles are actually keywords that adds to your generation. Instead of manually adding additional keywords to your prompts, the Style tab allows you to simply select and get the results that you want. Some styles are designed primarily to create realistic images, while others excel at creating anime. The model you choose has a significant impact on your results, so I'll provide you with a better comparison. I'll create two images in two different styles to show the differences. I'll start by creating a panda image using an anime style. As you can see, our image is ready. Now I'll switch from the present anime style to a semi-realistic style. Click the Generate button to see how this switch affects the results. Here is a side-by-side -side image comparison. This shows how simple it is to generate different image styles without modifying your prompt. Now we'll look at how to upscale the images. There are two methods for doing this. The first method involves enhancing an image during the generation process. Click the Enhance button. From here, you can select an upscale option based on your needs. For now, I'll use 1.5x to slightly improve the image. Simply click the Generate button. So let's skip the generation process. As you can see, it generates an image and then upscales it. Here is a side-by-side -side image comparison. The second method is to enhance an existing generated image. Click the Input Image tab and then select the Enhance tab. From here, you can upload an existing image. So I will drag and drop this previously generated image. Next, click the Enhance button. From here, you can select an upscale option as before and simply click the Generate button. So let us again skip the generation process and as you can see, our image has been enhanced. Here is a side-by-side -side image comparison. Let us now look at how to generate an image with LoRa. To use a LoRa model, navigate to the Models tab. In LoRa 1, select Film Photography as your LoRa model. You can even select multiple LoRa models for the same generation. Finally, click on Generate. So let's fast forward the generation process, and as you can see, our LoRa images are ready. It looks extremely realistic and stunning. Let's now look at how to use image to image generation. Focus allows you to edit an existing image with text prompts. Click the Input Image tab and navigate to the Image Prompt tab. From here, you can upload an image that you want to modify. I'll use the previous portrait image we created. I'll modify the prompt and replace American Girl with Japanese Girl. Now let us hit the Generate button and wait for the generations. As you can see, the face has been changed to a Japanese female. Here is a comparison of the before and after results. Let's now look at the in-paint and out-paint features. It allows you to modify specific areas of an image instead of regenerating the entire image. For example, I'd like to modify the hair color in this existing image. I'll upload this image to the in-paint tab. The top right corner has settings such as brush size, reset, and undo. So now simply paint over the hairs. Enter a positive prompt in the following box and click Generate. 
As you can see, our generated image has completely different hair colors. To outpaint an image, simply select the outpaint direction from here, then click on the generate button. Let's fast forward the generation process. And as you can see, our image has expanded. Now, change the method to improve detail. It allows us to enhance the hands, face, and eyes of an image. For example, I'd like to modify the face expression in this image, so I'll simply paint the face. Enter a positive prompt in this box, and the one box above. Click Generate and let us skip the generation process. As you can see, the facial expression has changed. That wraps up our tutorial on focus. Today we learned how to generate images from text, choosing the best style option, upscaling the images, generating images using LoRa, using the image to image feature. Lastly, exploring the in paint and out paint feature to transform an existing image. With focus, you can create high quality visuals effortlessly, all with a user friendly interface and minimal manual adjustments. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more exciting tutorials with Mimic PC.